this one stings to be honest with you because uh you know the game's there and just at a different opportunities felt like we just gave them opportunities you know third period i think we gave up maybe six or seven shots but uh but you know obviously it's not a team you want to put on the power play twice in the third period and then twice tonight we you know once after we score once after they score they score the next shift and uh and that can't happen you know and uh and so we we gotta obviously be better but there was a lot of good things i thought that a lot of guys competed really hard um extremely hard uh i thought that we were aggressive in most of the parts of our game at most times um but you know obviously you've got to do it every shift every guy every guy Yeah. Well, I think, you know, when we're when we're executing, I thought our defensemen <clears throat> for most of the game were doing a good job executing, uh, getting the pucks up to the forwards, allowing us to get to the offensive zone. And we're getting better in that area. We're spending a lot of time on video, a lot of time in practice working our offensive zone play. Um, obviously, D-men have to be available. They have to be part of the offense. And that that was uh, available for us as well tonight. Mm -hmm. I thought it just, you know, leadership, our veteran guys, it's, uh, it's easy to sit there and, uh, and feel sorry for yourself or, you know, uh, I, I think that they're, they're going out there and, uh, and still fighting and still playing hard. And, uh, and obviously that's a very good team that we were playing against tonight. And I think that we came out with the right attitude. We, we, we came out with the mindset that we want to take the fight to them and uh and you know we got the first goal and then boom they scored right away and then next thing you know they score right after that um that could have been a game where it got away from us but it didn't and uh for us to have a second period like that that's that's disappointing we got to find a way to close those games out um you know too many good things uh not backed up by you know all the way through and uh and obviously we're gonna have to correct that we got some good opponents coming up and uh, and we can't be satisfied with one point. We can't be satisfied with mostly good efforts. We have to have everybody here. Yeah, I think Michael seemed to have some good, and then the penalties obviously were an issue as well. What did you make of his overall performance? Well, I thought that you know maybe compared to some other guys, I thought that uh, at, you know penalties. Obviously, he's got to correct that. But at least I, I did think that he was trying to be assertive in the game. Uh, you know, so he, that's a learning. Uh, you know, if, if we talk about it, we'll address it with him, and if he can show that. Uh, uh, that he can improve on that, then that's a, that for me is just a young player at that, you know, learning how to how to perform at that level at, at that time. Um, but I do think that he was a little bit more aggressive and assertive than some other guys out there. So a little bit of good, a little bit, of, you know, obviously some things to work on. Coach, obviously you're more worried about what your team's doing, but having Coach Sidney Crosby in the past, any comment on just seeing him score 500 goals? Tonight? Yeah, I wish he did it against somebody else, you know, or at least we got the win. Um, but obviously, uh, um, knowing him the way that I do, uh, it's hard to sit here and say I'm happy for him, but uh, um, he's an incredible player and I, I definitely am very grateful to have the chance to have coached him.